So this is the first um, uh, first design of the burner. It's got a MIG tip in there. I think it's 0.6 mil. Um, 0 0.02, 0 0.025 inches, something like that. I think it's too small, but we're going to go and test it. Um, the air adjustment is just literally lifting that thing up and down. Uh, and we don't need to worry too much about um, sealing it. It's actually not as critical as you might think. Uh, so it doesn't need, you can put Teflon tape on, but Teflon tape just gets in the way and it'll probably block the jets. Uh, there is a concession to safety. It has a valve on it this time. I've tried this before. So, on off valve for the gas and a tapered end. So, about three inches of 112 taper on that, which is the received wisdom tells me is the way to go. We'll soon find out. That'll do. That's just to hold it steady and you know make sure you've set fire to the right thing. That's fine. All right, let's go play with it. Standard airline fitting, absolutely fine for gas at this pressure. If I switch that on, yeah, that's right. Okay, gas on. Lighter. So air screwed off. Um, should just be a little soft flame. And as soon as you introduce air, you'll start to draw it in. So you end up switching it off. Well, I don't know if you saw any of that. Definitely on now. Open up the air. That's with a tiny amount of gas. Gas. I think that's about right. I think that's about maximum. On the air back down. Oh. That is oh. right on the edge of being the exact 
sort of flame that you want. And then it's unstable. Uh, yeah, it's unstable. So let me gas down a little tiny tad and then we'll be fine. But very close, nearly. I think what's happening is, I think the jet is, so this is cool to the touch, he says. And this is, yeah, it's okay. Hold it. Um, it's very sensitive at that point. It's very sensitive to this gas uh, adjustment. So I think the nozzle size is too small and therefore the gas is coming at a very high velocity, dragging too much air in uh, and giving me too rich a mixture which is not, you know, staying uh, afloat, I was going to say. All right, so I'm going to try it with a bigger jet. So this time, uh, because I ordered up the wrong size MIG tips, I drilled out the MIG tip to about 1.2 inches. Uh, 0 0.045, 5, 0 0.05 bang, something like that. Uh, and so that's too big. So I've gone from a, 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 a one that I think is too small, about 0.6 mil, and I've gone, I've doubled it to um, 1.2 mil. It's way too big, but that uh, should allow me to open the air up because uh, the It'd be a much lower velocity and therefore uh, it will suck in less air. So for now. a lot more air. You can open the air right up on very low pressure gas. Come on. So if I shut the air right off. So there's just my flame. I should be able to just shoot flames. And then give it a little bit of air without setting fire to my GoPro. Should start drawing air in and give me a nice neutral flame. That's, uh, you, well, you can hear the amount of gas. Uh, I've got my lovely cone in the middle. Alright, oh, pretty good. That's pretty good. I think I can stick that in a forge, that'll be fine. I'm still opening up the air. Some stage is going to blow out. Okay, so I can't open up the air any more than that. I guess if I turn the air down and turn the gas up, there's a lot more gas that's just going to blow out. Yeah, that, that's too long. So I want less pressure.
I have no idea what that is. <laughs> Not working. Not working is what that is. So I might just turn the regulator down, actually. Um, turn the regulator down. I don't have to be too sensitive on this handle then, so I should be able to turn the handle up. mean I've got maximum adjustment here. So with the so now I've got with the regulator turned right down to where it maxes out. Um, I should have maximum adjustment here so this should work in every position. I think. Right, that's enough. We'll frighten the neighbours. We'll write this up. <laughs> 